So as I tell you, the water box is a copy of Mother Nature, which means that uh, you actually plant on top of the soil. You don't make a hole. You know, people make a hole, then plant a tree in it, and then close the hole again. But what you do in that case is that you destroy the transport system of water. So if you do that in a dry place, then the soil that you put back in that hole actually gets to dust, and the tree will never grow. So with a water box, you plant on top of the soil, using and keeping intact the capillary system that transports water from the bottom of the soil to the seed or the tree that you plant there. Now, the water box also makes water with the cover through condensation, and the side of that, it captures water through rain. And I found a way to have an opening that's big enough to catch a rain shower, but in the same time doesn't give any possibility to the water that you've stored to evaporate. In this way, you create a water battery. Now, this water battery is sufficient to tap every day 50 milliliter of water to the plant that you've planted in the middle of the box. Now, this water is sufficient for the plant to survive, not sufficient to grow. So you actually challenge it to make roots, go deep, and find water to live on its own. As soon as you see that the branches really start to grow, then you know that it found sufficient water to survive. And you lift the box and you plant the next tree with it. So one box gives you the possibility to plant about 10 years, 10 trees. And this way is by far the most cheaper system to reforest the world.